Now let's talk about calculated items within pivot tables. So here's our example um, where we have some sample data for, a, uh, for our lemonade stand. And we know that pink lemonade is a very hot item. So, but how much, what percentage of our overall sales is pink lemonade in, um, in respect to grape, orange, purple, and red lemonade? Let's find out. Go to calculations. Um, and notice how when I, um, I'm, I'm clicked on the data area and the calculated item is not available. You want to make sure that you're clicked on either the row or the column area. So if I go to calculations now and I go to calculated item, it's available. And so now I'm going to create a calculated item and I'm going to call it pink percent. And what we're going to do, we're going to take our pink, and again, I put the, the asterisks in front of pink percent so that I always know that that's a calculated fill. So I'm going to take pink, and I'm going to divide that by the sum of our total cells. So it'll be grape plus orange plus pink plus purple plus red. Click OK. Um, it's formatted as a number, so let's format this as a percentage. Let's give it one more decimal place. Okay, so this gives us our percentage of pink lemonade cells in regards to the rest of our lemonade. And so like if I want to take out my customer name, I can see my overall um, overall, pink lemonade is 64.3% of our overall sales.